Oh no, no, I drowned. Now we're gonna throw a funeral. Grim Reaper, do you wanna come to the party? You gotta put on a bathing suit though. It may not look like it, but we are all mourning the loss of Noah. Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of recreating savage things that people have done to their sims. So if you didn't see the last episode, or the reactionary episodes that came before it, they're all linked in the description below, but basically, I find savage sim stories that people have told all over the internet, and then I see if they're actually possible by recreating them myself in The Sims. And usually I go to a really dark place, and I feel really weird about myself, but I just need to keep reminding myself that this is all not real. These sims are not real. Please don't demonetize me. But I mean, if I am, I understand. Because these stories today are truly savage. And I ran out of time before Halloween, so it's coming out right after Halloween, but it's in the Halloween sphere of things. But anyway, I thought I would start off simple with this classic savage sim story that I've talked about before in my reactionary videos, but it's that one time I killed the sim by drowning. Then I made everybody show up to the funeral in swimwear. Classic, easy, savage, we're gonna do it. So basically, I downloaded both of these super good-looking sims, may I say, from the gallery, and I put in this pool. What do you think's gonna happen? I don't know what this guy outside is doing. Anyway, the story does say his funeral, meaning that the sim that dies is a he. So, Noah, super good-looking Noah, you're gonna go in the pool. Crap! Why did the neighbor come in the pool? Come get him out. There we go. Cool, he's out. And we are just gonna box Noah in. Let's do it with a fence so we can actually keep an eye on him. I mean, not like he's going anywhere. There we go. Noah, you enjoy that. And then we have Mia. This is super inappropriate, sir. I have just met you. But I do need to make some friends to invite to the funeral. And also, I did download her from the gallery, but I tweaked her a little bit to kind of make her look like this girl, the crying girl from the, uh, uh, photo. So she's got like the slick back hair that's up and that bathing suit. This might be from The Sims 3 though. But either way, I gave her the slick back hair that's tied up and her bathing suit is as close to the other bathing suit as I could get. Now we wait. And in the meantime, you need to make friends. Yeah, it's the welcome wagon. We literally had one creepy guy come over who immediately got into his speedo and started trying to talk to me on the couch. So I think you can leave. Ask to leave. Oh no, sad doggy out in the rain. Let's invite him in. Oh, it wouldn't let me. Let's meet you. Let's meet you. You're making so many friends. Just running around in my swimwear. Yay, we have so many friends. Noah, how you doing? Uh, he's like, not very good. I mean, but hey, if you look at his reflection in the water, it looks like he's smiling. I think I'm gonna have her come out here. And take a picture, just to make it a tad more savage. He's like, what are you doing? Help me. Sorry, Noah. You know, your name is ironic, because Noah's Ark, he got away from, like, the water and didn't drown, but this Noah is gonna drown, and then we're gonna throw him a pool party funeral? Noah, I'm so excited for your pool party funeral. <laughs> He's like, please. Please help me. This is too savage. It's okay, guys. He's not real. She's not real. This whole situation is not real. But I'm gonna play in some mud. <laughs> it's a stray puppers. It's so sad. Oh my god, we gotta come pet it and save it. See, I may seem like a terrible person because I'm letting Noah drown, but I am an animal lover. Let's leash him up. <laughs> Take him out. Yeah, you go, buddy. Oh, he escaped. He ran away already. Well, that was quick. Mm-hmm. Actually, you know what? We should just set up for the pool party now. <laughs> this is so bad. I know it wasn't technically a pool party. It just said that they dressed up in bathing suits. But I mean, if you're going to be in bathing suits, you might as well have a pool party. Let's have a water balloon bucket and a slip and slide. Let's get some decorations. They're blue, like the color of water. I mean, Noah, I want you to be able to see the party, you know, before you can't be there. <laughs> Let's get some fish tanks. We're just gonna theme this all water. Catch of the day shop. Uh, yeah. Best funeral ever. Let's do these, like, balloon light things. Yay! Look how cute this water funeral is. Uh, he drowned right on prank day. You were pranked, bro. It was just a prank, bro. 
Oh no, so sad. Mia, come out here. First, put your bathing suit on though. There we go. Oh no, no, I drowned. Who knew? And on prank day, let's put his gravestone over here. Right in the middle of the festivities, so we all remember why we're here. Call forth ghost, what? I didn't know you could do that. Okay, let's strengthen our connection with him. And now we're gonna throw a funeral. <laughs> None of these really match. Just say a weenie roast, but not gold. There we go. I'm hosting. These are the only new friends I have. Fine. And here, Grim Reaper, do you wanna come to the party? You gotta put on a bathing suit though. Oh, that's right, we gotta take down the fence. Don't worry, the pool has been sanitized since the incident. Oh wait, and the photo. Oh, did my finger get in front of it? What is that? My finger! The last photo that I had of him before he died, and I ruined it with my finger. Oh, God. It may not look like it, but we are all mourning the loss of Noah in our swimsuits in the pool that he drowned. It was sanitized, though. Don't worry. And look, we got a slip and slide going. People are having a good time. Let's do a water balloon fight. And every now and then, you know, we'll come over here and we'll mourn Noah. See? See? And now we're gonna have a water balloon fight. Oh, wait. I didn't get higher vendor. There we go. It keeps saying we're having a water balloon fight, but we're not. Oh! Who wants seafood? It's what Noah would have wanted. He just loved swimming so much that we themed... Oh, God. We could buy, like, actual fish. Oh. Not, not real food. Just, like, actual fish. What's this, though? We we could buy that. That looks like regular food. I don't want to cook my food. Let's fully stock all these tanks with fish. Wow. Noah would have loved this. Too bad he didn't get... Well, he got to see some of the setup, but he didn't get to see the full setup. Look, everybody's in their swimsuits having fun. Oh, yes. Oh, it's Speedo guy. Memories. Poor, poor Noah. In the pool that we definitely drained and disinfected before. We had this funeral and everybody went in. All right, that's a good uh, savage start. A water themed funeral for somebody who died, like right after they died in the pool that they died. Pretty savage. All right, moving on. All right, so this next one, I think I've also talked about before, but the Savage Sim story is I made nine glass boxes. One, I don't know why nine, because there's supposed to be eight in a household. So I'm just gonna read this as, I made eight glass boxes and trapped Sims inside so the neighbors could watch them slowly piss themselves and starve to death as they passed by. I am also wondering if they can talk to one another through like the glass. I guess we'll find out because we're gonna recreate it, of course. All right, so I found this household on the gallery, of course, and they were actually called the Glass Throne group and there was a couple of them so I don't know what that actually is but glass throne glass boxes yup look I made eight glass boxes and we are gonna teleport each of them in and I'm wondering if they can I think they can talk in between so maybe we could have some of them fall in love and or become best friends before they perish. Just to, you know, make it even more savage. Put my little touch onto it. Oh, are we missing one? All right, we'll grab one other person that we find on the street. What else we got? Who we got? Come on, somebody walk. Somebody come. Oh, here we go. Who's this? Oh, it's a kid. Boo. No, we need an adult. I need an adult. Oh, look at them all. They're so neatly in their boxes. Oh, who's this? You. Add to family. Then you come here. Perfect! And now all the neighbors that walk by can see them on display. In the meantime, can they talk to one another? Oh no, they can't. Okay. You can't talk to one another? You can see each other. There's these people just standing out front. I don't know if they want to like come say hello, but they can't because there's no front door. I don't... Where'd you get... Where'd you get cake? Oh no. Oh wait, I think we have roofs. Yeah, we have roofs. We're good. Oh, it's thunderstorming. Ooh, I just realized one of the roofs you can do is glass. Let's make this a full-on glass experience. Oh, yeah. Copy that. Copy that. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Look at this. You guys are in total glass boxes now with glass roofs. Oh, and people are coming to watch in a thunderstorm. It's like we're at the zoo. I don't know what else to do, though, besides just, you know, wait. Literally, everybody's just standing around watching them. I think this girl got struck by lightning. Oh, yeah, this is, this is some savage stuff. They're like gerbils. Whoa, lightning just struck right there. Are they all gonna die at the exact same time? Ooh, this girl just keeps getting struck by lightning. 
Why are you guys outside just staring at us? Oh no, they're all peeing themselves. And everyone can see. Or this group that apparently is like stuck here, it looks like. Well, the storm is over. We survived. All right, I think it's time to start killing some off. Let's do it in some creative ways. She kind of looks like a vampire. So we are gonna turn into vampire. Okay, because now she's probably gonna burn to death because uh, she's in a giant glass tube where the sun can hit her. But I don't know, maybe not. She seems fine. Maybe because technically she's inside, it doesn't matter. Okay, well then we're just gonna go the easy way. Oh, poison you. <laughs> What? Oh, I've never seen. Uh, what? I've never used these MC commands before, the death commands. I always wait and do it the old fashioned way. You sick neighbors that are out here watching. How dare you? What do you think this is? Some sort of circus or zoo? Well, then you would be right. Death by pufferfish. I've just learned about this, but usually don't they have to be sitting? Oh, oh, God. Uh, he just fanned it. He turned into a puddle. This is him. He vanished and he melted into a puddle. Okay. Rabid rodent fever. Sure. Huh? Uh. 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 What is this? Oh, uh, I've never seen that death either. That was horrible. Okay, she's back to looking normal. What was that? I didn't even know these things existed. Everybody's watching out here. Are you enjoying this, you sick people? Even though I'm the one that set this all up. Okay, what else we got? Death by anger. We're literally showcasing all of the deaths in The Sims. She just got so angry that she died. What a way to go. All right, what's in store for you? Uh, death by laughter. <laughs> He's become hysterical. Uh, again, what a way to go. One of these is death by cow plant, but I feel like it's just gonna melt him into a puddle again. Yep, he's gone, he vanished. Okay, what about old age? Even though he's a young adult. That's why he had silver hair. He was an old soul. Oh no. I mean, if anybody went a good way, it was him. He just died of old age. Alright, now we got you. The last one standing. Let's do... Lightning. Whoa, what a freak accident! Well, Grim Reaper's literally taking his time. All the neighbors walking by are, are watching. Not really. Nobody's nobody's even paying attention. This is pretty interesting stuff, guys. It's in it's in glass. You can see exactly what's going on. There's you're literally walking by people that are dead. Literally walking by people that are dead. Little kid, don't walk this way. There's dead people. He's like, eh. Video games have desensitized me. All right, well, uh, I guess this challenge is over. Time to move on to the last and most savage. All right, so this last Savage Sims recreation is so savage that it may actually get this whole video demonetized. But you know what? I just, I had to do it. I had to see what this was gonna be like. It's still kind of around Halloween time, right? Like this is covered under the Halloween blanket. And I'm just gonna say over and over again not to do this and that this is not real and maybe maybe the youtube gods will bless me with some monetization on this video but yes you guessed it the last savage sims story that i'm gonna recreate is the baby barbecue story so i covered this in my reaction video to savage sims things but to refresh your memory here is the gif it's horrifying. And the story is, I barbecued my baby because my baby daddy was annoying AF. I mean, valid reason. Then I served up the barbecue baby at his dinner party. Oh god. So for my first recreating Savage Sim stories, I saw this one and I was like, there's no way I can recreate that. But then I came across a Delagracy video where she barbecued babies using a mod that I did not know existed. But now I do. And now I need to make this video. So yeah. 
Let's see how this goes. I'm so scared. All right, all we really know from that gif is that the woman that cooks her baby is blonde. And I'm pretty sure, yep, this couple over here are the perfect candidates for this. All right, here she is, the baby cooker. This is gonna be terrible. Here's the first time I'm gonna say it. Don't barbecue babies, please. It's horrible. Also, this is not real. Please don't demonetize me. All right, so me and I'm guessing this is my husband. Nancy Landgrab and Malcolm Landgrab. Please don't be my brother. Oh no, I have no love. Is he my brother? Teen, oh, is this my son? Crap. Oh, that's my son and my husband was killed. Oh, probably from the first Savage Sims episode. Whoops. Oh, I know. Let's revive Sim. There we go. You're alive. Great. Oh, he still kind of floats though. The game is like confused if he's still dead or alive, but it's okay because either way, I'm gonna ask to try for a baby. Oh wait, I think this is our son's room. Oh well, that's just how savage I am. Me and my half-ghost husband going to make a baby in our teenage son's bed. Savage Sim strikes again. Stay down there if you know it's good for you, son. Okay, let's check if we're pregnant. Oh my god, she's walking around the house like this. Your son is gonna see- you seem like the type that's gonna barbecue your baby. Oh, you're not pregnant? I think this is our room. Oh, this might be our room. All right. No worries. We didn't mentally scar our teenage son. Great. Oh, it's love day. Perfect. Pregnant? Pregnant? Yay! Pregnant! Now please put some clothes on. You have a teenage son. Oh god, you're getting closer to him. No, 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 no. Stop trying to be the worst mom ever. I mean, she's gonna be the worst mom ever, but she's being the worst mom ever without me even trying to make her do that. Okay, so now apparently her husband's supposed to be super annoying. So they are gonna argue about music. Oh no, their relationship is falling apart. Look at this. Oh, oh no. Alright, he's just gonna keep being mean. Oh, she just went and kicked the garbage can! Oh, she's mad. Very angry. Oh yeah, oh their marriage is falling apart. Oh, it's falling apart. All right, and now pregnancy phase. Let's go third trimester. Look, look at that. She grew right in front of our eyes. She's still very angry though. We gotta really make them hate each other. Riff the bull. Yeah. Ah! Oh my God, he's just the worst. He's the worst. Oh, it's just getting worse. It's just getting worse. Oh, they really hate each other. Oh, they're in the red. Oh, he's leaving. He's leaving. Okay, well now it's ready for her to go into labor. Let's just have the baby here. No need to go to the hospital. I mean, we don't want people having evidence that I had a child. <laughs> oh, this is getting real dark. Oh, I'm so scared where this is going. Okay, we're gonna put the baby. Oh my God, this room is so scary. Yes, the baby's gonna go <laughs> right in the middle of this blood red room. Oh, it's happening. It's happening in the super creepy room. It's a boy. Uh, let's just get a random name. Something that sounds like food. <laughs> this is so terrible. Eh, can't find any names I like. Let's just name him Delicious. <laughs> oh god. Oh, this is gonna be so awful. Oh, he's so cute. No. No. This is too savage. Oh no. Oh no. He's too cute. Alright, well, we gotta feed ya. Make you big and <laughs> I can't! I can't, this is too weird. I just opened up this and it just goes, Malcolm, delicious. And Nancy, oh no, gosh. All right, well, uh, it's getting close to dinner time. And you know how uh, Jeffrey or Geoffrey, I think it's Geoffrey? And you know how much Geoffrey loves his dinner parties, as we've heard from the story that started this whole savagery. Uh, so he's gonna throw a dinner party. Slash, congratulations on the new baby. All right, so plan a social event. <laughs> then she just creepily stared at him and walked by. Dinner party. Host Geoffrey and Nancy. Just invite everybody that we know. No caterer. We'll do our own cooking. Perfect. Oh, look at him. He got all dressed up. So did she. Nice. All right, and now there's a special item we need for this dinner party. So this mod that I got, oh, here it is. It's a round charcoal grill, a grill perfect for your grill parties. I mean, no need for this one anymore. Let's just, uh... Yeah, and the one in the GIF is right near a window, so let's just do that. Okay, this looks great. 
right, let's make some grilled food. Use fresh ingredients, of course. Baby shaped meat. Yep, come here, delicious. I'm so scared, guys. I'm so scared, guys. I'm so scared, guys. Oh no, the guests are coming. The guests are coming. Where is she? Oh no, there she is. There she is. Ah! Delicious, no! Oh, oh. Whoa, oh, oh no. Is it on fire? Crap! Crap! Delicious! This is going terribly! Extinguish it! Extinguish it! Exti Stop cooking the baby! Stop <laughs> putting sauce on the baby! Seasoning the baby! You need to put the fire out! Put the fire out! There we go. Don't worry, guys. Our meal is still gonna be delicious. Totally normal. See? See, it's still- it's not burnt or anything. It's still- Delicious. This is so scary. Oh my god. This is the most sad. Oh, 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 this is. What am I doing? What is this? What am I doing? We're just gonna say this is part of Halloween. This is part of my Halloween content, okay? That's what this is. That's the only way this will be acceptable. Oh god. Oh my god. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Ah! 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 Oh, they took a- they took his leg! Oh! Oh! I did- uh, I- uh, I don't know how to act anymore! Oh god! Oh no! Baby-shaped meat. Oh- oh god, everybody's- I guess call- call to meal? Wait, Geoffrey needs some. Make sure somebody saves some for- Oh god! Oh no! Make sure somebody saves some for- Joffrey, the worst husband ever, the whole reason this happened. Oh, oh, she's freaking out. Oh, Joffrey took the last piece. He took the last piece. Oh, 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 God, they're all, they're all eating delicious. I can't believe I just did this. I can't believe this is even a thing. I, uh, I feel real weird. Oh god, wait, there's- there's pe there's a piece left! Delicious! Oh, maybe there's not a piece left, I just have to clean it. I just had nobody wants the top- the top half, no? Uh, you know what? If I get demonetized for this video, I accept it. I understand! Oh god, oh, is he taking the- the- the trash out- the baby- oh god, he just put it out on the ground. Oh, it's the brother! Oh, it's his brother! It's the brother taking out the remains of the baby, his baby sibling. Oh my god. Okay, this is too savage for me. Um, I think, uh, I think I'm done. <laughs> I think I'm done with this episode. <laughs> We're just gonna write it off that it was, it was part of my Halloween content. Even though it's, um, past Halloween. We're just gonna say it's Halloween to make ourselves feel better. Yeah, that's literally, that's literally the mod. You buy this grill and it allows you to cook baby meat. Okay, this one doesn't feel as terrible because we don't know who, whose baby this is. We know it's not delicious. So I don't feel as terrible. Oh god. All right, guys. Well, if you made it this far in the video and you like seeing these recreations of Savage Sims, even though it kills my uh, soul a little bit, I'm just kidding. They're pretty funny, but they're they're pretty messed up. As you can see, they're pretty messed up. But I enjoy them. And if you enjoy them too, and you made it this far in the video, then make sure to leave a like before you go. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I put out new videos every single day. Not videos like this every single day, but actually pretty close. And as always, I will see you guys soon. What?